A new school year brings change. A lot of change. There was definitely a lot of change for the students returning to the school in Corinth. WTVA's Bronson Woodruff paid a visit to the school to see how the first day back went. It's a big day at Corinth High School where today students and teachers had their first day back in class. Corinth High School reopened today after being closed for months because of the coronavirus. Superintendent Lee Childress said students and teachers had a great first day back. <laughs> students were excited to go back to school. It would have sounded ironic a year ago, but according to Superintendent Lee Childress, to students at Corinth High School, it was like Christmas Eve. We have seen um, large numbers of students are showing up today. Uh, it's something that our community wanted. As you said, there's an excitement um, in the air that we're returning to school since it's the first time since March. According to parent Tara Williams, her kids have been excited to go back for a long time. They are just excited to see people they haven't seen in a while. She said she loves the steps the administration has taken to keep the kids safe. She said Childress gave consistent Facebook Live chats while school was out to keep parents informed. She said those talks and safety measures have reassured her the kids are as safe as they can be. I know wearing masks has kind of gotten to be political or controversial, but I, I support it and I think it's a fairly painless way to take away some of our risk. Williams added she is grateful the school district gives the choice for in-person learning or online learning. As far as safety goes, Childress said it remains top priority. We've taken the precautions that have been recommended. We have um, looked at everything that has been put out by the American Academy of Pediatrics, uh, in addition to the CDC and our State Department of Health. Uh, we're following those guidelines along with other measures that we've put in place to do what we can to create the safest learning environment that we can. Children said each of the students received two masks and one lanyard. The lanyard clips to your mask about right here, goes back behind your neck and clips to the other side, like the lanyard you'd see on a pair of sunshades. Childress said this keeps students from having to lay them down and helps to keep the masks clean when the students have to take them off. Reporting in Corinth, I'm Bronson Woodruff for WTVA 9 News.